<sighs> Waiting for the recording to start. Pfft. Hey! No, no, no. What's up, guys? Are you ready for some freaking dancing game? Because I sure am. I am hella stoked. We've only got 28 days until the ball, you guys. I have no idea what this game is. Me neither, really, except there's dancing. It's a dancing rhythm game. This is terrible. This lag is terrible. What's going on? Man, I'm beat. What should I do now? It wasn't this bad last time. I I changed the settings to make it better and it made it worse? Anyway, let's go to bed, I guess, because we can't do Jack otherwise. Princess Hugh Dancy! Uh, is this like Iowa Master or n not really? I mean, we named we named we named our princess. Uh, well, we named her. She's not actually a princess. See, let me give you a quick rundown of the plot. All right. So we are Hugh Dancy, and we were like chilling out with our friend, uh, Catherine, and Catherine. And she was like, "Man, it's so freaking boring here." Ugh. First world problems. I wish a prince would come and sweep me away. And so then they get into this discussion about princes in their school. And none of them actually have real qualities that sound like princes, but whatever, Catherine, whatever. And so she go Hugh Dancy goes home and uh oh yeah, by the way, we named her Hugh Dancy because I referred to this as a dancy game. And uh then we got into a topic of Princess Hugh Dancy. And so then we just named her Hugh Dancy. Um, but we we end up going home and we go to our closet and then a portal opened up in our closet and like this freaking thing here, Kip, and our doppelganger from another universe shows up and she's like, hey, we gotta switch places because I'm a princess and I can't dance. I don't know how to dance with the ball. So you should take my place even though you done nothing I've done nothing to confirm that you actually know how to dance any better than I do which is a major hole in her her plan there but anyway so we we uh, end up going through the closet to Narnia said not really Narnia and now we everyone thinks we're a princess even though we don't really look, I mean we look like the princess but the princess has green eyes but no one seems to have noticed um, and apparently the only way to get back uh, the princess has that with her, so we, we're stuck here. So we're gonna court some guys, I guess? Cat, what is it? I'm trying to be a, be a dancing not princess. There's only 28 days until the ball in St. Lion. It is very legit. The traveling market. Oh boy! For the next three days, the traveling market will be in Samba Square! Oh boy. <laughs> well, I'm stuck in this alternate universe posing as a princess. Might as well court some boys. Well, actually, they're kind of being thrust at us, so. Alright, I'm ready for another day. The traveling market is in town today. Let's go check it out. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Great. Let's get going. I really get a choice. If I said no, you'd drag me, I bet. This is Samba Square! There are many shops lining the street! Wow, 
there's so many shops! The traveling market only comes once a season! It's always so busy! Try not to get lost! Oh, Candy! Can I buy this? No! Never mind that! Come this way! Rude! You're gonna get fat, Hugh Dancy. <laughs> okay, let's go to the giant meat on a bone shop. Oh yeah! Giant meat on a bone shop! That's my favorite! Okay... <laughs> she has a very okay face. Follow Kip to the accessory shop. I can't eat this. Welcome! We have lots of accessories for you to choose from! Why is everyone so casual with me? I'm a freaking princess, you know. I mean, even as a traveling market, I would think that people would... Whatever. What? Accessory? You dancy, we're in an accessory shop! <laughs> Magical accessories, why don't you choose one you like? Hey, Firebee! Welcome to Princess Debut! Your clothes transform into a wonderful costume when you put on an accessory! Even if you have a partner, you can't dance the ball if you don't have a pretty dress to wear. Whatever, you're not the boss of me, Kip. I'll wear what I want. Hmm, which one do I want? Oh boy, do we want a seashell necklace, a coral necklace, or some silk ribbons? These are tough choices. Where's the one that makes us turn into a pedalo? Is that what the meat one does? Yes. Are we turning Princess into Lady Gaga? No, we're turning Hugh Dancy into Lady Gaga. It's very different. We're turning Hugh Dancy into a princess, and we're turning the princess into Lady Gaga. I don't like necklaces. Ribbons always win. Well, let's see how they- how they- what color are they? That's important. You're sure you want the silk ribbon? I don't even get to look at it first! I noticed that we got here through a closet. When will we have to go through the, to run from the Oni's? Oh no! I want to. I want to make an Oni my dance partner. That's super legit. I'll be the best at the ball because everyone else will be dead. <laughs> You have to shop blindfolded. Oh. Transform! What the fuck? Those are. Those are like. Is this gonna be like a China dress sort of thing? This is not what I was expecting at all. Hair buns. Man, I was just thinking. I was just thinking a second ago that the shopkeeper- I didn't say anything about it, the shopkeeper reminded me of something out of one of the Princess Maker games, and now we have a rival! She just got hella Princess Maker! <laughs> there are two tiny hats. I thought they were- I thought they might have been hats, but I was- I was like, why are there two of them? <laughs> We got double hat because we're double classy. Hey, I was going to buy that one! A girl, Isabel. How do we know her name? We don't! This is. This is. Whatever, narrator. Oh, really? Yes! I've been saving up my allowance for three months! How expensive are these freaking tiny hats? <laughs> Well, I guess I can exchange it for something else. Like I'd want anything that you've had your dirty hands all over. Rude! <laughs> we just picked the name for her. Isabel left. Okay, bye, bitch. 
You know what I really want, though? Is one of these, like, masks back here. Is you stream being funky? Y'all still there? Um, did I do something wrong? Oh, don't worry about her! That's just Isabel. She says all sorts of mean things. She loves to cause people problems. Just ignore her. Oh, I see. I guess this place isn't that different from my school. Wait, do you know that chick from your school? Is that like a parallel? Because I'm assuming that most everyone we're gonna encounter is probably at some point. Or maybe not, maybe there are just some random people, but now I'm gonna have to stop and imagine what they are in the other world. You finish shopping and leave the shop. You leave the shop after shopping. To shop around some more. Well, what should I do now? Look at the market! You begin to take a walk around the market. Get out my face, Vince! Oh, hey, it's you, Dancy! What are you doing here? <laughs> I shouldn't be too- I shouldn't be- I shouldn't be, uh... Shouldn't be outright rude to any of them. But what do you think I'm- I mean, realistically, what do you think- I'm in a freaking shopping district. What do you think I'm doing? I have bags with things that I have purchased. Why is everyone in this game so dumb? Anyway, how do you want to respond? Is the best option. Well, if you insist, I'll go with it. Just leave me alone. I'm busy. You seem to be in a bad mood today. See you later, then. On my face. Well, what should I do now? Anyway, like I was trying to do. You continue walking around Samba Square. Hmm? Caesar is hitting on a girl. But when he sees you, he turns his back on her and walks over. You know, okay. So, I'm gonna try, uh, yeah, the lag seems to be really bad, I'm sorry, guys. I'll have to see about, uh, fussing with it again some more later, but, anyway, I'm thinking I shouldn't be outright rude to most of them, I mean, cause, you dancing isn't, isn't a rude I mean, she's pretty forward from what we've seen, but I don't think she's quite as rude. But now I just wonder what sort of event we might have triggered there. Shh, shh. Anyway, we can be civil, but we ain't gonna put up with this kind of womanizing bullshit. If we, if we get the option to tell him to shove it, I'm alright with telling him to shove it. Did you, we've... Oh, wait, no, I forget. Caesar is actually, uh... He knew the princess already. I was gonna say, we just met, like, yesterday, dude. You're already calling me baby? Really? But no, they have a- they have an existing relationship. Or lack thereof. Anyway, baby, we meet again. Ah. How you doing, girl? Running into each other like this is in a credit market? Surely it must be destiny. I think we should honor this moment with a tender embrace. 
Tinder embrace? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Feel a pretty uncomfortable guy. No way, sir. That's weird. You're weird. No way, I'm out of here. You did future. <laughs> ah, playing hard to get, are you? Splendid. I'm determined to make you mine, Hugh Dancy. So you're one of those types, huh? You spend a little more time checking out the traveling market. Oh man, I'm beat. Oh, but I didn't get to... I wonder if there was... Whatever, it's gonna be in town for three days, so... Pepper spray! <laughs> Maybe we should head back to the castle. You and Kip head back to the castle. You return to the castle, but you realize that you've lost something. What? Where is it? Hmm? Ooh, what's the matter? It's not here! The ro wow! You dancy, good going! Oh no! You can't transform into the princess's dress without that tiara! I can't find it anywhere! Where- How did you- Where did you put- I mean, like, you weren't walking around carrying it, were you? I mean, how do you lose it? Whatever. Where- I can't find it anywhere! What am I going to do? You must have dropped it somewhere in Samba Square! We've got to go back! Okay! <laughs> you just put on an actual dress? No. Ah, uh, well, it was good having you at least for a brief period, Alex. Oh wait, you know what I should do? Um, I don't know if it'll help any, but let me. If I turn this down a little. Does that make the quality really funky? I don't know if- I was- I turned the quality down. We'll see if maybe that helps with the lag a bit. It's tight to rip so she can pull it out like a gun. Ah, look at these happy clouds. So cheerful. Okay, let's look for the tiara! You dumb shit! Go somewhere else, bye! I'm done. Where do you think you're going? We have to look for the tiara! Ugh, I really want to go somewhere else. Fine. You and Kip search Samba Square for the tiara. I can't find it! We need to keep looking! You and Kip search again. It's gonna be in the accessory shop? Girl, did you freaking leave it in the accessory shop? Now what's her face is gonna buy it, and then you're gonna be totally screwed. Did you find it? Anyway, uh... Let me know if... The quality got, I mean, if the lag got any, or the choppiness got any better, since I assume it was fairly choppy. I can't find it anywhere. Oh! Luciano! Lu Lu this asshole! Oh, Luciano! Hey, you look worried. What's the matter? I'm looking for the royal tiara. Have you seen it? Royal Tiara, now that I think about it, I saw an obnoxious girl with long pink pig nails holding it. Freaking called it! Isabel, she took it! Luciano! 
Okay, so do we want to get him to help us look? Help us find her? Maybe he can help us, uh... Corner. Can we order for excuse? You need to think. The decision is yours. <laughs> he can hold a rally punch. Yes, good. That is that is obviously the way we should go. Will you help us look? That sounds kind of like a pain. Anyway, I've got somewhere I have to be. Oh, okay. Well, you know, if you if, if you want to miss it, if you want to miss out on the throwdown, that's that's your loss. Oh, okay. I like this guy only a little more than the others. So far, he seems like the most normal slash less least creepy wait what is that noise what did i hear what's going on what's it okay go. jai park you know where that is kip you would think the Royal Tower would be a thing that you don't just- You'd think, but apparently- I mean, she's also not really a princess, so she's still kind of getting used to this. Jive Park, though. Yes, of course! I hope you find it. Thanks! Oh, yeah, thanks! Luciana leaves. He's nicer than I thought! Hey, we have to hurry over to Jive Park! All right, let's go. We are gonna wreck her. I hope we have to have a dance off. You and Kip rush to Jive Park. Bye. We have to look for Isabel. Fine. You and Kip search the park. You can't find Isabel anywhere. She's not here! She must have run off somewhere! She could be anywhere. What should we do? Oh, hey. It's so convenient that we just keep running into all these princes. Klaus walks up to you. Hey, aren't you Hugh Dancy? You look like you're searching for someone. Oh, Prince Klaus! Actually... You tell him the whole story. Well, that's terrible. Shall I help you look? That would be great! Are you sure you don't mind? Not at all. I actually know this kingdom quite well. Yay! Thank you! Wow, that's lucky for me. Considering I'm supposed to live here and I don't know shit about this place. Let's start at Samba Square. No, we just came from there! Klaus, you're useless! Oh my gosh, is the lag really that bad? Holy cow. I know it's, but I... Hmm. I gotta figure out how to make it... How to make it work better. I makes me sad having such a delay with you guys. While you're looking for Isabel, you bump into... Who the hell is this? Liam! Huh, he's got green hair. Huh, huh. Green, huh. But anyway. 
Hey, Prince Klaus, how are you? Is this Bulbasaur? Hi, Prince Liam. H who are you? You just freaking took. She. You dancing? Do you have cotton in your ears? Nice to meet you. I'm Liam Goodrich from the Green Kingdom. Ha. Huh. Green Kingdom. Wait. You're. It's not even like themed like something. It's just green. Oh, nice to meet you, Prince Liam. You seem a little frantic. Is something wrong? Actually, you explain what's going on. <laughs> These poses! They really do make me think of, of some of the goofy scrun faces. I'm sorry, but I haven't seen anything. Then you're useless to me! Shoves out of way! Oh... Are you grocery shopping, Liam? Yeah, I was just buying some vegetables. Carrots, potatoes, onions... Hey! The carrots are missing. What? First the tiara, now the carrots? I don't think these things are related at all! Who took the carrots? Could it be... Liam! Liam did it! You obviously took your own carrots to set up! <laughs> I'm tempted to blame Kip. Just because... I want to see Kip. Actually, it probably is Kip. But... I don't know, these are all good options. Which one do I pick, guys? I mean, they look kind of rabbitish, so I wouldn't be surprised if they ate carrots. This music is so slow paced, like, because it's so slow, it feels like... Like something out of Harvest Moon, or something while you're, it's like, walking around farming. One vote for Isabel. I'm gonna wait till I make sure everyone's heard it. Isabel took the carrots. We're just gonna make her out to be the villain. Though I am tempted what what dialogue goes down if you say Liam. Did Isabel take them? I'm sure she did! I'm sure! What an awful thing to do! I'm going to give her a piece of my mind when we find her. Uh, may I interject? What is it? I can understand why a girl would take a tiara. It's a sort of devious looking face you have there right now. But why would the same girl then go out of her way just to steal some carrots? What is Liam wearing on his head? Is he wearing... He's got, like, what looks like a... Oh, I didn't think of that. Okay, I don't know if he's wearing... I know he's got a little uh, emblem sort of thing on his vest. I don't know if he's got something on his head, though. Om nom nom, you have a point, om nom. Hey, Kip! Just what are you eating? Oh, just some carrots. I picked them up off the road back there. Delicious! Th those are Liam's carrots! Not anymore, they're not! Oh, really? I already ate them all. <laughs> well, at least we know who took them. At least now we know who took them. 
If it makes you feel any better, they were quite delicious. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's got anything on his head. I'm glad you enjoyed them. Hmm. Hugh Dancy, we don't have time for this. You're right. I almost forgot for a second that I'm really mad at this chick. See you later, Liam. Good luck, Hugh Dancy. Isabel, just where did you go? Wait, where am I going? I forget where I was told to go next. I really like how we see a full body sprite of him, but we still see our little half sprites. It makes me think that word is like incredibly short compared to all of them. Let's look for Isabel. Nah, I've changed my mind. Oh, they actually let me, okay. You, Klaus, and Kip look around for Isabel. Then you see. Oh, it's another prince, of course! Ah, it's Prince Vince. Oh, hey guys, what are you two up to? Well, actually, you explain the situation. You're Tiara, huh? That's terrible! I know. Hey, Vince. You're no use, Vince! We shouldn't be too mean to him. That's why we need the dress that Tiara gives us to hide the stills. Should we just grill him for information? I don't really care what he's doing here. He likes spaghetti. Now you know. Wait. Okay, I thought I was... He's freaking 17? Well, I guess Caesar is 16. How old are we? We are unknown age, question marks. Then who is other dancer? We just don't know. Do you know anything about where Isabel might be? Hmm, a girl with long pink- You know, her hair- her pigtails didn't really look that long. Nope, sorry. But you guys look like you're having tons of fun playing detective. <sighs> we are eternal. Hugh Dancy is eternal! It's not fun at all! You're so insensitive! I'm <laughs> sorry. Well, if I see anything, I'll let you know. Really? Who <laughs> did <laughs> I love how you just change moods on a dime. Of course! Thanks, Vince! You... Just leave it to me. Vince... Slides away. <sighs> I like it. I love how... Klaus seems to be really irritated whenever we talk to other guys. This bodes well for this relationship. We are missing a glasses character. You're right. <laughs> Kip is the glasses character. You're right. That's why when we asked him to transform, he wouldn't do it because he's secretly he's secretly the last the last romantic interest. Yeah, that sounds good. Isabel, just where did you go? <sighs> We've already searched here. Let's go look somewhere else. What? We've searched everywhere, man! 
What do you want from me? Let's check my room. Hey, you want to come to my room with me? Oh man, I actually can take him to my room. <laughs> this is pretty forward, of, pretty forward of you, princess. I guess she's not here. Dun, dun, dun. Kip is mortified that we just brought a guy into our bedroom. Dun, dun, dun. Well, let's just keep looking. I love how how you dancey is just so happy and smiles. Okay. <laughs> Maybe. What's his face? Has seen him. Let's look for Isabel. You're looking for Isabel when you run into <gasps> Tony. Why do you look so worried, Hugh Dancy? Well, actually, shit happened. Ah, I see. Isabel was here, but she left a little while ago. She always goes to Venice Waltz Lake after a lesson. Why don't you look for her at Venice Waltz Lake? Venice Waltz Lake! Venice Waltz Lake! Hey, have you remembered it yet? Venice Waltz Lake! That's right. Oh my god, they really. They keep saying it. I was just joking, but then they really just keep saying it. Rainy's Waltz Lake in the forest area. All right. Oh my God. All right. Let's check out Rainy's Waltz Lake. Let's stop by the castle while we're over here. Let's look for Isabel. You all look for Isabel, but you can't find Isabel anywhere. She's not here. Let's go try somewhere else. This bitch! We're gonna just walk all the way around town. Let's look for Isabel. All right, let's check out Venice. Wait, no, neither of them is talking here. Is this just like a? Is this the narrator? Isn't that Prince Luciano? Hey, it is. I wonder what he's doing. Ah, I love the ocean. It really calms the soul. He's talking to himself. She's at Venice Wall Plate at the bottom of it. Heh <laughs> heh. Klaus, did you hear that? Yeah. He thinks he's at the ocean. <gasps> Luciano! Wait. Wait. Wasn't this the, uh... Early onset dementia patient one? So I see that's kind of carrying through, huh? Boy, you cray. Um... This is a lake, right? Yes, it's a lake, you dancy. It's Viennese Waltz Lake. Viennese Waltz Lake. Viennese Waltz Lake. Yeah, it's a lake. <laughs> okay, so do we want to call him on it? Or do we just play? <laughs> do we just do we just humor him and play along? Last time he seemed to be pretty pretty receptive whenever we just corrected him. Like whenever we, he ran into us, he was like, oh yeah, that's right, huh. Ha, <laughs> his love's down to 5%. <laughs> Of it twenty percent. <laughs> Save me needs Waltz Lake. How do we get all these guys' affection so quickly? 
Tillman is great. All right, <laughs> let him have his dreams. Very well. The ocean is great, Luciano. But we're at a lake. Huh? You're Princess Hugh Dancy, aren't you? And yeah, you're right. The ocean is great. But this ocean is strangely calm. Almost like a lake, in fact. I think he really thinks this is the ocean. I cannot resist a natural pull of you, Dancy. Princess. Prince Luciano is famous for his terrible sense of direction. What's more, if you point out that he's wrong, he gets really angry. Oh, really? That's just like Lucas. So, did you want something? Please tell me there's a harem option in this game. If there isn't, we're going to make a harem end. Well, we never said this wasn't the ocean, true. Have you seen a girl with long pink pigtails? You're still looking for her? Yes. Did you see her or not? This is my alternate universe sprung head cannon. Then it reminds me him freaking his face, his pondering face reminds me of Lucas's pondering face. The thoughtful chin to thoughtful holding chin pose. Some of the questionable intelligence is about on par, too. I did. Where did she go? I don't know. <laughs> but she did say something about forgetting something at practice hall. Thanks. Wait, no, actually, she's still ang making an angry face. Thanks! Klaus, let's go to practice hall. Okay, let's do that. He was pretty chill about his talking to Luciano. Still quietly expecting you to turn out to be some sort of Yandere, though. Can we go surfing on the ocean? We're gonna take a pedalo out on the ocean. You and Klaus arrive at the practice hall. Oh wait, not at the practice hall, at practice hall. When at that moment, there she is! Hey, Isabel! <gasps> Just then, Isabel passes by, holding the tiara. Tut, tut, tut. Hey, you thief! Give me back that tiara! What, this piece of junk? Isabel throws the tiara down and runs away! I threw it on the ground! I don't need your tiaras! I can accessorize for myself! I'm a princess! Actually, I don't know if she's really a princess. We... I think we... That's just a random chick slash rival, not actually a princess. Ah, uh, I hate her! Well, the important thing is that you got the tiara back. I'm just imagining that now that... Because the tiara got... Pro I mean, if it got banged up... The, tr the transformation is going to be funky, and the dress is going to look funky. Thanks, it's all because of you, Klaus. Actually, Klaus didn't really do much except tag along, but okay. You're very welcome. By the way, that tiara... Does it have sentimental value or anything? No, but the tiara does have magical powers! Oh, really? Like what? You can become a princess. You don't say that. I mean, you're supposed to be a princess all the time. Did you tell him that we can fly? It's super legit. 
Though actually I am I am tempted to see if we say that you can become a princess if uh you get called on it. I'm pretty sure we can fly. Haven't unlocked that ability yet, but You can fly! <laughs> You're such a kidder. No, I'm serious. Yeah! I wish I could fly. Well, I really have to go. Thanks for everything today. Cross leaves. Princess, we should be getting back to the castle. Okay. But we still have cake left! Ah, we wasted our day worth of cake! Which TV is fence? Oh, excellent! What do I want to do today? Hmm. There's so many more places I can check out now. The traveling market is at Samba Square right now. There are more people than usual walking around. You look around, but you don't see anything interesting. Oh. But... Bone meat! Hey, there's Caesar! Turn right up back around! Don't call out to him. You decide not to call out to him. Caesar leaves. Good. Well, what should I do now? A beach. The waves here crash to the beat of rumba music. This must be an important place because we got a description before we came here. We should go practice first. Pick on the spot. Nope! I'm surprised he didn't follow us. I was expecting him to see us and come at us. I ain't got no time for your weird objectification of me. That's <laughs> some really talented water. Ah! Hi Vince, how are you doing? Well, I had some free time so I thought I'd stop by here. How's your dancing going? <sighs> the rumor players must never stop, otherwise the raves will. It's sort of ominous sounding. I should have looked around the beach first, I wasn't expecting this. I was expecting him to be on the beach. We're we're kind of we're kind of dancing. We're dancing okay. Probably. I mean, we could certainly be dancing a lot worse. I wish I had an inventory. Why won't you 
would your love go down? Ah, it's so easy. I mean, look at Sam leave. <laughs> it's so easy whenever I'm not freaking losing my shit. It's so easy! I could dance a waltz in my sleep! Wow, you're pretty confident. Darn straight! All right, then I'll give you a little test. Oh, shit. A test? Yeah, I want to see if you're just all talk. <laughs> Why do I have to prove anything to you? <sighs> anyway. Hey, man. I mean... He's, he's, he's throwing down a challenge. I accept your challenge! Even though I have nothing to prove to you, I'm gonna do it just because I'm such a badass, and maybe we won't have to dance to that slow song. We're gonna have to dance to that slow song, aren't we? He called us on our bluff, man. Let's go! Throw down! That's the spirit? Wait, do I have to dance with you? Ah! It is a china dress! <laughs> We're wearing a china dress. Whoop whoop! Transform tiny hats. Magically you become a princess, I guess. I gotta think of lyrics for this this part. You will change into something. Make sure you boil your hands after making contact with him. Whoa, it's got like a weird like a Single sleeve sort of thing going on. Okay, gotta get ready. All right, we can do it. I want to yell in his face. I want to do good combos and then just yell. Sorry, I can't read the chat right now. I have to focus intensely on dancing. I wanna be impressive. Must level up, must get more kick, must never dance, talk to him again. Yes. Hey, you're great! Aw, oh, thanks. I am, aren't I? My eyes twitching a little bit. I was gonna say that these circles ones kind of threw me for a loop, but then I realized that that was a bad joke and it wasn't even intended to be.
you guys. All right, let's do it. I wonder if she makes any songs beyond the Yahoo. That one was sneaky! Freaking broke my combo there at the end. Whew, they both look put up. Not bad, not bad. Didn't beat our highest score, but still, not bad. How was that? Wow, you are really good! <laughs> All right, since you did so well, I think you earned a present. Vince takes out a small wooden box and hands it to you. Oh, wow. I wonder what it is. Should I open it now? Yes! You gotta open it! Wait, what if it's a trap? Because the, uh... The whole name of this chapter, or whatever, was. Mischievous Vince, or something like that. <laughs> what if it's a bomb? Well, if it's a bomb, we better take it out and defuse it. Right? Anyway, what do you want to do, guys? Shall we open it? At least Vince dies with us. <laughs> but I suspect it's some sort of prank. Does he just carry presents around with him? Yes. He's like an Animal Crossing character. What if it's a music box? Oh no! Alright, we gotta open it now. You open the wooden box and it's filled to the brim with worms! Ah! Ha! <laughs> you fell for it! Slam that right in your face! But what is this? Worms? You jerk! Hey, no need to freak out, it's just some bait! Man, that was funny. I'm keeping this box, asshole! Funny? I can't believe I fell for that! You didn't actually, you Nancy. We were you were conscious of the I mean maybe on your level you weren't, but on a metacognitive level we were we were very aware of the situation. Man, just wait till you see my next prank. It'll be even better. More pranks? Don't even think about it! You're lucky I don't punch your lights out. You must like to fish. Boy, you're really angry! Time to skedaddle! He wobbles away. He <laughs> got away. I can't believe that, Vince. It looks like you're out of stamina. Why don't you go back to your room and rest? Let's meet back here tomorrow. I'm gonna go to the beach first! What are you gonna do about it? Wait, no, this isn't where I meant to go. I need to back at the park. No! Kid! I don't know. We're done. Punch him, Nancy, hit me. I wonder if we went to the lake, if we'd find... Luciano there, admiring the ocean again. Oh, 
All right, I have to call my folks. Uh, we can either continue when I get back. We've only been at it for about an hour. Um, or uh, whatever. So. Hang on one sec, let's see here. I'm making an off-air message. Okay. I'll be back here in just a minute, guys. Turn the audio off so you don't have to listen to this weird laggy music. Did I turn it off? I just want to turn it off. No, say off when I turn you there.
So now I'm back. While I was away, I drew a MS Paint draw. I drew a quick MS Paint doodle of Hugh Dancy for you guys. Get ready to punch some people. As she is wont to do. What's... What did I do? Did I break everything? No, it's okay. So I was drawing while I was talking on the phone with my folks. I'll probably try to draw something better later, but the there's a weird lag trying to draw with MS Paint in my tablet. I'm glad you enjoy it, though. Wait, I was supposed to be going to bed. Oh man, look, I have so much ex more experience soon. It's only 26 days left until the ball in St. Lion. No pressure. I just saved. Oh wait, I guess I'll save at the... I keep forgetting I have a mouse. I don't need to use the trackpad. Present from Kip. Oh boy! Hope it's not freaking warm because I am so sick of that. Can you imagine that she just like, I got you a present! And it's like... No! She just takes it and throws it! I have had it with you people in your presence! Bullshit! By the way, Princess, the dance competition is tomorrow, isn't it? Dance competition? I wish you the best of luck. Do our kingdom proud. Dance competition? I think it's a dog. You wander to the accessory shop. Oh boy! I can't wait to see what they have today! You entered the accessory shop. Welcome, we have lots of accessories for you to choose from. Hmm, what do I want? So wait, do we don't- uh, are we just putting it on the kingdom's tab? I mean, do we just get it, like, no questions asked? No, you just bought something the other day! What? Practice dancing and show some improvement. Then, I'll buy it for you. Okay. <laughs> oh, well then I guess we can just leave. Rumba Beach. Not much going on in the Rumba Beach today, huh? It looks like Liam is at the park. Liam! I don't get an option to not talk to him. Oh, hello, you dancy. You're looking quite cheerful today. Of course! I'm always cheerful! <laughs> what are you up to, Liam? I thought I'd take a walk. How about you, you dancy? I was taking a walk, too! Ah, I guess we had the same thought then. I know, why don't we take a walk together? I'd rather be alone! Okay, I mean, I don't- sure, why not? As long as I still get to dance after this, I mean, this isn't gonna wear out my stamina.
Sure, sounds great! Excellent. It really is a wonderful day for a walk. You and Liam walk around the park. What, we don't get a cutscene? A cool Reese rustles the A cool Reese rustle. A cool- Wow, we both like books? Hey, at least that's better than- That's still better than, uh, Caesar who's like, Oh, we ran into each other! Destiny! A cool breeze rustles the leaves. Cool breeze rustles the leaves, cool breeze rustles the leaves, cool breeze rustles the leaves. Oh, that breeze feels so nice, doesn't it? Yeah. Would you like to sit down at that bench? Hmm. Do we want to keep walking around, or do we want to chill out here? We might find something super cool if we keep walking. Or he might end up being like sickly, you know, because he looks kind of me. He might end up being some sort of sickly guy who like faints or whatever whenever. We walk too much. Walk to keep your legs in shape. Sure, he is Leo. Walk him. Yeah, let's keep walking around. <laughs> this is the most fun <laughs> manual comment. He's Wally, yes. He is Wally. It's true. I actually want to walk around a little bit more. Oh? Well, okay. You two talk while you stroll through the park. Well, that was nice. Yeah, I'll see you later, Liam! The two of you leave Jai Park. Bye! You have to keep walking in the tall grass and catch it for him. Atta girl, you know where it's at. Oh man, there's like a freaking theme park. Can't wait to go there. Look at this tree. This tree has a face. We are gonna like freaking. One of these areas is inhabited by uh, wispy woods. He spot Vince walking by himself. Hey, Vince! I, I'm still really amused that Caesar is the only one we have an option of ignore, like, just walking away from. Oh, Hugh Dancy, what are you doing here? Just taking a walk. Hey, just like me! Let's take a walk together! No. Sorry, I need some alone time today. Oh, okay. Later. I want to investigate the area. Who Dancy, you're not perceptive. This is Jai Pop. People are walking, playing, and relaxing in the sun. You look around, but you don't see anything interesting. But at least we don't... <laughs> we don't see, uh, Caesar. So, there's that. You need to use Detective Dancy. Attention for that. Ah. Uh. I guess we'll practice for the contest that we don't, we, that Kip hasn't told us about yet. You seem to be in good spirits today. Did you come for dance lessons? Nope, just walk right back out. Bye! Then let's begin. Whoop, 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 whoop. Get this over with.
It's weird because the dress set here and what she actually ends up wearing don't look quite the same. Are links on? They were earlier. Let me take to make sure that they remained on. Yeah, they're on. We good. You found a princess picture of Princess Hugh Dancy. Did you? Well, then you have to share with the class. I haven't eaten. I'm sorry, stomach. Don't worry. I'll feed you here in a minute. I mean, aside from the popcorn I ate earlier. I had some pudding. I had a pudding cup. And I ate it for after work today. Well, not after work. It was before work was over. It was delicious. Just want to load the picture. No, you are making this so difficult for me, Tumblr. Why? Why? Tumblr, I can't hand this layout is just No, it's not fair. Okay. Let me zoom out. Oh, this is perfect. This is Pudding cup! Rest in peace, pudding cup. Okay, so here, we're gonna look at this. Do you see it? I don't know if it's actually in the... Let me scooch it over a bit more. There we go. Wait, I went too far. There. Okay. Beautiful. This is everything I needed. Thank you. Pudding cup was our Poutina in, um, I did a Nuzlocke one year for, um, or I started a Nuzlocke of Sapphire for, uh, a stream one year. And Pudding cup was our Poutina and our first casualty. Where did the street? Oh shit, what did I do? Okay. It's alright, we're back. Transform into a magical princess, kinda. I'm really gonna have to start and try to think about lyrics for this. I'm pretty sure pu I'm pretty sure Pudding Cup was a dude. But then you were infamous for your getting the uh, So who knows? I'm gonna impress this rabbit with my hella sweet dancing skills. Oh, does it actually have both arm sleeves, but one of them is like different? Uh, well, it's dead anyway. Yes. Yes, it is. My hand is getting tired from holding down the mouse click. Looking good. Keep it up. Aw, yeah. Look at all these stars. We're doing that one. It's like freaking Samara RPG up in here or something, man.
Let's do it! So many wishes. She's getting into the Mario spirit. Oh, oh, she was a really leads of death. Oh. Please. Say we could maybe turn off the top screen for this and see if that helped lag, but then you wouldn't get to see these quality models. You also wouldn't get to see the see what the next step will be, but you know what if. It's not like I'm really looking too actively at it anyway. Oh yeah. Oh look, they're so cute. No beds! Nailed it. Well, not perfectly nailed it, but we did pretty darn good. Good job, Dancy Chan. That was perfect! Great work. That performance was on a Dancing Legends level. Oh, pff, you flatterer. Technique rose two points. Artistry rose six points. I'm <laughs> Pete. It looks like you're out of stamina. You should go back to your room and rest. The dance competition is tomorrow. I'm looking forward to watching you dance. I thought we were supposed to be getting a present from Kip. This shirt title was very misleading. Maybe Kip will stop me when I try to go to bed? I mean, I guess I... Otherwise I feel very confused as to why we were even... There is something washed up on the shore. Oh ho! Huh, I wonder what that is. Pick it up! You pick the object up. Oh, it's just a stick. Shoot, it looked like something interesting from far away. You throw it back into the sea. Hey, sticks can be plenty interesting. You can use that for self-defense if Caesar comes around. Sticking him in the face. Oh wait, I didn't mean... <laughs> oh, I'm here. Might as well look around. There ain't nothing going on here. 
We out. It is a mystery. Pop some balloon to the stick. Check here once more and then we'll just go to bed, I guess. You spent months walking by himself. No, I I'm still I'm still having alone time. That's still a thing. It didn't stop happening. Alright, let's go to bed. Time to get some sleep. I feel like I was betrayed. There was no present giving here. Just in case I missed something, but I don't think I did. Or did I? Because now we have a, a thing there and... The hell? So where, but where is, don't get you game. Princess, how long are you going to stay in bed? As long as I want. <laughs> Wake up princess, today is the first of the two dance competitions this month. Hurry up and get dressed, you've got to keep it your best. But what now? Yes, it's an important event. This is your first chance to show how much you've learned. Can I just skip this one? It's way too early. No! How dare you expect to get better if you don't gain experience. Okay, okay. I'm so not a morning person. Kip drags you to the dance hall. The dance hall is filled with pairs of people ready to dance. Wow, all of these people are going to be competing? Teaser approaches you. Uh, that's right, honey. We're all here to dance with all our hearts. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I promised to princess with the. Oh wait, I partnered. I've promised to partner with the king. <laughs> I promised to partner with the princess from Walnut Kingdom. Oh, I wish that you and I were partners instead. Please forgive me, honey. Like I'd ask you. Like I'd ask you. <laughs> Playing hard to get, are you? Well, I suppose I deserved that. Farewell and good luck. Bye. Get lost. Well... I better see if I can find a partner. You can't leave! Look around and see if you can find a partner! Ugh. You see Vince standing alone, looking downhearted. Hey, what's wrong, Vince? What's with the long face? Oh, hey, Hugh Dancy. I couldn't find a partner, so I didn't register. I was really hoping I could dance in this contest, too. Are you trying to guilt trip me? Oh, really? Well... I like how none of these options... None of these options is actually... I'll be your partner. We'll just ask him to dance anyway. Just dance, do, dance by yourself. Make it happen. Why don't you dance anyway? I can't! I have to be registered, and I have to have a partner to register. 
Hold on now. I actually brought an extra ticket. If you paired up with Princess Hugh Dancy, I'll be willing to give it to you. Oh, Kip, you asshole! No! I am not being set up for this! Screw you! No! Kip, you punk! What? Really? Alright, you dancy, let's do this together! I mean, I feel like a jerk because I got, he, Kip got your hopes up, but... Sorry, bro. I guess that was my last hope. Uh... Now I feel kind of like a jerk. Hmm, isn't there anyone else? He's loved at 27, though. Don't stuff the ticket in Kip's mouth. Just take the ticket and eat it. Sorry I didn't tell him that there's always next time. Oh. Liam's in the audience. Hey Liam, aren't you competing? Oh. I would like to, but I don't have anyone to dance with. Well... It's still exciting to watch the dancers, even if I'm not competing. Don't feel like a jerk. Remember, he gave you worms. Oh, true! We just pranked him back! Let's watch together! I wanna say that- I wanna say that and then have Kip get pissed at me. What say you, gang? Try to- try to sneak out. Blend into the audience. It's no use, Hugh Dancy. They'll be able to spot you in an instant because you're the only one with normal colored hair. Liam, let's watch together! Yeah, that sounds good. Wait a second! Princess, you have to find a partner. Oh, yeah. Crap. Sorry, Liam. Maybe next time. Okay, good luck. You leave Liam. What a lovely girl. Ah, That's kawaii. Man, there's nobody. What am I going to do? <laughs> we have to go chase chase Vince back down and apologize. Sorry about being an asshole earlier, except I'm not really sorry, but here's a pity ticket. Let's go compete. You take a look around, but you don't see anyone who would make a good partner. You're on... You're on! You look around a little more, but you can't find a partner. Oh, what a disaster! Wh what? I couldn't help it! Of course you could've! I guess we'll have to ask Tony. Yeah! Let's get over to practice hall. You and Kip arrive at practice hall. Tony, could you dance with the princess for the competition? Come on, princess, you asked too. Ah, oh, forget it! I give up. Tony has- Tony isn't trying to, uh, win me over, so I feel- I feel okay with dancing with him. Though you'd think he's a freaking dancing instructor, won't that give me an edge? Does no one think about this? Whatever. So do we wanna- I mean, I'm totally cool with dancing with the rabbit. I wonder if we would have been able to... I was kind of expecting us to be able to get the option to ask, uh... Liam. I'm surprised we didn't. But I guess maybe if we had another... Or maybe it wasn't an option at all, who knows. Anyway. I like the way this has panned out, this is good.
please. Would you dance with me in the competition today, Tony? Please? You couldn't find a partner? Uh, something like that. Okay, I'll be your partner for today. We owe you one. Go on, princess. You thank him, too. Th thank you very much. Don't mention it. Tony is your partner for the dance competition. You head back to the dance hall. <sighs> we managed to make it back in time. I was never worried. Wait, were we wearing the dress the whole time? I can't remember if it was... If we were, so, we were still wearing the dress when we talked to him just then, but whatever. Right before the dance competition begins, Klaus and Cynthia walk up to you. Wow, Cynthia is actually decent looking. How do we know her name is Cynthia? Whatever. It felt modding. Hey, you dancy, you're entering the competition too? Yeah! Are you too, Klaus? Nice to meet you. I'm Cynthia, Princess of the Marine Kingdom. I'm Hugh Dancy. Nice to meet you, too. Hey, you're the one who was dancing with Klaus at the dinner party, aren't you? Oh, was her name Cynthia? I thought it was... Okay, that makes more sense, because I was confused about... I thought he was dancing with someone named Catherine, but this makes much more sense. Oh, you saw that? How did you think we did? Well, apparently, it was really- I mean, their dancing was really excellent. So, I mean, I guess I, there's no point in being rude to her. She doesn't- she seems like an okay chick. Let's be best friends, Cynthia. Yes! I mean, I'll be- I'll be pals with all the ladies. I'll take you to a magical place where animals don't talk. So we'll be nice to her. Oh, you two are just spectacular. I was spellbound. <laughs> You're making me blush. Thank you, Hugh Dancy. I wasn't talking to you, Klaus. You're too kind. Let's both do our best today, Hugh Dancy. All right. Do we want to be uh, competitive? I guess we could just say all right. Let's be positive and cheerful. Well, I guess both could be, but she might interpret the I won't lose as being rude. Either option's fairly ginky sounding. Aren't you just full of energy and pep? Yeah, all right! The dance competition is starting. What the heck is this? What is your... What is your face? Your eyes are really far apart. The MC takes the stage. Somewhere in the other world, there's someone who looks like this. And now, let the dance competition begin. The first couple steps out onto the dance floor. They compete a tricky move, and everyone applauds wildly! The next couple falls in the middle of their routine. They don't score well. This makes me want to go play Princess Maker. The next couple has a wild, flamboyant dance that makes the audience smile. <laughs> this is what happens <laughs> when enemy people get older. <laughs> their, their eyes start to spread apart. <laughs> and our next pair of dancers is Hugh Dancy and Tony. <laughs> My first competition. I'm so nervous. It'll be okay. Just dance like you're dancing for fun.
Why aren't you wearing your dress? Oh, okay. We'll bust up the Royal TR for this one. Oh, we didn't have a transformation sequence? I guess because we were already wearing it? I... Whatever. Let's blow it up. I'm ready to make it happen. That's for for civilians. Uh, of course. <laughs> My cover is a crime fighter. We need to protect Princess Hugh Dancy's secret identity as Hugh Dancy. Ah, oh, of course. Thank you for reminding me. That was almost disastrous. Though I have to wonder if we had changed pick because you obviously she was wearing this dress already because you saw it in the sprites. But I'm wondering if we pick the China dress, does she transform out of the out of the regular dress into the uh, China dress, it's like some sort of like Animal Crossing sort of thing where she just flips out of one outfit into the next. I hope this is entertaining for you guys to watch. Oh shit, I broke my great combo. I was doing so good at only getting greats, and then I accidentally okayed. But still. He reached even more bonus points for going wild. Wow. I hope so. I hope that that we, we, the judges take that into consideration, my enthusiasm. Thanks for sticking with it. It's weird that there's only 39. I've been drawing during Dead Sea just because I've done this song a million times. Well, I'm glad... 
I'm glad it's enjoyable enough for you guys. I worry that this is just like boring as hell. It'd be funny if we did our best and still don't win. <sighs> it's over. Good work. Let's see how we did. All the participants have finished dancing. Folks, the wait is over! Now to announce the results! The winners are... Hugh Dancy and Tony! Give them a round of applause, everybody! Alright! Well, first place, huh? Hugh Dancy, you must be a natural at dancing. It's in my name, man! <laughs> no way! I only did well because I had you as a partner, Tony. Even so, first place isn't something that comes easily. Hugh Dancy, congratulations. I'm really happy for you. Thanks, Tony. And now to present the prize to our winning pair, Hugh Dancy and Tony. A magical choker. Yay! You received the magical choker. Yeah, we did it. Princess, don't get overconfident. I won't. With the dance competition at its end, when you're just wait, when you're about to leave, when nice work out there, Luciano, you came too. Yeah, I was invited as a guest. Prince Luciano was last competition's big winner. Oh, really? You're not going to enter, Luciano? You think it's already over? I've quit dancing. Oh, I s okay. I probably won't be coming around here much. Hey, how was my dancing? <laughs> <laughs> it was terrible. Your steps were weak and your rhythm was off. If you're not willing to take it seriously, then you're done for as a dancer. The road to dance is a road- wait. The road to dance is a road of roses. Remember that. <laughs> What's so funny? It's just that you're still very passionate about dance. Of course I am! I've been dancing all my life. But I'm done with it now. I'm leaving that behind me with stares dramatically off into the distance. Princess, maybe you should ask Lu Prince Luciano to be your partner? Hmm, well... Do we ask him? Though I'm sort of wondering if he turn us down and be like, "Bitch, didn't I just say I'd freaking I freaking stop dancing?" How's my dancing? Call five 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 Q. Comfort sticker on the back of a dress. Yes, beautiful. What if we just ask all the guys in session? We just round robin among them. He's dedicating his life to watching the ocean. I am okay with Lucas. <laughs> Thinking about the lake ocean again. <laughs> Ask him anyway, maybe he's already forgotten. <laughs> True. Luciano, would you be my partner? Why should I partner up with you? Because. I'll take any partner. Way, way to play it cool, Hugh Dancy. I want to be the best, but also you creep me out the least. So it's a little bit of column A and column B. Telling him that we like him will probably just get him to be like, <laughs> and get all huffy and, you know, embarrassed and stomp off. But telling that we want to be the best might 
uh, speak to his passion. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. Save state one. I put it in save state. We're gonna take. I, I have to see. I just. I have to know. I don't care who my partner is. Then ask someone else. Way to blow it, princess! Ah, oh, nuts! You left! What did you expect to happen? You dingus? To tango is my real quest. To tap dance is my cause. Da da da! Actually, we should use Tango for uh, travel, maybe, or make the sound sync a bit more. I don't know what we could use for the C. Anyway, which one do we want to do? Do you want to be the very best? I want to get better so I can be the best dancer in the world! Best in the world? That's impossible for an amateur like you! Please, with a partner like you, I know I could be the best! You want to be the best that badly? Let me just warn you, I'm really strict when it comes to dancing. Okay, hang on, this is probably the route to actually do it, so now I'm, I have to go see what happens if we tell him that we like him. It's not cheating, I just want to see how he reacts. Shh. Give me a break! I hate people who dance for reasons like that. I had a feeling it would be something like that. <laughs> Did I say something wrong? Shut down, girlfriend. Shut down. Anyway, we want to be the very best. Bring it on. All right, then. We're partners. Yeah! Woo! If you're out of the country partner, oh, look! Why wow, we got a really high love thing going on here? We're practically married! We start practicing tomorrow. I'll be waiting at the practice hall. Oh, wait, at practice hall. So you better show up. Got it! And don't be late. See ya. Luciana leaves. Woo! Thus, your first dance competition came to an end. I'm just gonna dance with all the boys and aim towards our goal of harem end. No, I just wanna just let me Goodbye cat. Flower Expo. Alright guys, I have to go get some food in me. Sex will be held for the next five days. How exciting. Birds chirp cheerfully to greet the morning! Slam the window shut. Thanks for joining me, guys. Uh, I had a lot of fun. Hope that you enjoyed it. Even with the goofy dance things. Um, I will see you Saturday, alright? So have a super fantastic one.